Hello there, this is me, DoraCast93, and this is going to be a sort of another different video. This one is going to be about the evolution of a prism jump. As we all know, the prism jump has gone through three different phases. The prism jump, the prism act, and then, I don't know if it's finally, but the latest to be revealed is a prism live. First, I am going to go over a prism jump. A prism jump is said to have come from the heart. And, as every prism star can do, they can do at least one prism jump. But a prism jump is not classified to be one single jump. There are many different variations of that jump. There could be one that can summon, that can, uh, what is it, bear fruit, that can have fruit. There's some that can have bananas, others that can have planets, others that can have honey. Um, dolphins, um, stardust comets, eh, anything. And basically, it all depends on the girl's heart. Or the prism star's heart. Because, of course, it's not limited. Yeah, you get what I'm saying. So, basically, the I believe the highest form of the prism jump that has been shown in the series has to be Aurora Rising. There are two vari three variations of this jump. There are Aurora Rising, the normal one, Aurora Rising Final, and Aurora Rising Dream. So, and there's another prism jump that I consider to be on the same level as Aurora Rising. And that would be, um, was it Big Bang Beautiful Birth? And that was before performed by Takemine Mion in episode 50. I believe, yes, either episode 49 or 50. So... That has been like a little bit of an analysis on prism jumps. Um, after that, there is going after this, there is going to be an analysis on prism acts, and that will be coming up soon. So again, I hope you enjoyed this analysis of a prism jump or the evolution of a prism jump this series. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys later.